There, I wanted to uh, uh, show you what I've been working on this afternoon. It's um, some Clips All C bus integration with Node.js, and it's all uh, I've got it um, so that it can run on my Raspberry Pi and uh, serve up a little web page uh, to let me control my lights. So, uh, again, the code is in, in Node.js, uh, just uses a local. Um, file for storage uh, of names of stuff. Anyway, I'm going to go fire it up here. Um, we fired it up, it goes out and it just basically queries the entire network and finds all the devices that are on my uh, network and stores all the values for those. And so when you come in, this is the interface that you're presented with. Um, and basically it's just a list of all the lights in the whole entire house. Um, and from here, I can fire stuff off. I know that group 51 happens to be the room I'm in. So if I turn that on and off, it'll go. And then I can also do it from the wall. Let me go fire it from the wall, and we'll see what happens. There's off. There's back on. So, <clears throat> um, so uh, there's little, I don't know if you saw the little alerts that were coming down in the in the lower part here, but... If I was to turn off, say, the main light in the office, it would say main in the office is off um, and uh, so forth and so on. But I, some, it gets a little confusing with just group whatever. Um, so I created over here in the settings page a place where you could just assign a name and a location to it. Um, so we know that 51. Oh, and on this page, too, by the way, it also throws up those little alerts. Let me go fire it and show you just to help locating um, the uh, different loads. Once you've located it and you know you want to assign it a name, you can name this as the main and the master. And uh, we're going to go ahead and save this. So when we come back to our screen here, we can see that the main and the master bed. Um, is on and here is kind of interesting you can see the actual level that it's on that's a level between 0 and 255 I probably need to normalize that down between 0 and 100 but um, it only shows it if it's on here's one that's on level 2 you know so if I was to go and uh, let me go and um, ramp the light and the master down and you can see that it'll change the value of that So I ramped that down, and now you can see that it's down here at 118. So uh, anyway, that's where it's at. It's kind of nice. It's all responsive. You can size it down to what you'd have like on a mobile mobile web page, and it'll collapse all the all the commands and stuff. Um, and then you can also uh, obviously pull it out. And uh, so right now I've very rudimentary. Uh, filters and uh, ordering it. I like to order it by what's on in the house just so I can quickly go through and shut stuff off or, um, but you can also order it by location but anyway uh, kind of a cool Saturday project hopefully uh, be putting some more love into it over the coming uh, days and weeks so anyway we will uh, talk to you soon